Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2018 Panini Contenders Football 3 box random team break number 1. Yeah, chance at Josh Allen cracked ice autographs, a lot of nice stuff here, no vet common ship. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. A lot of people buying their teams or their spots straight up, which I appreciate. And congrats to the uh, winners of spots in that prestige football hanger box break we just did a few moments ago. All 32 teams are in. Let's do it. Let's roll it. Let's randomize names and teams. Six and a six, a full 12 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelfth and final time. To 12, we've got Kennard on the pole, Bill in the 32 spot. Six and a six, 12 times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelfth and final time. After 12, we've got the Arizona Cardinals down to the Houston Texans. So here's how it shakes out for you. Kennard with the Cardinals, Jake with the Ravens, Steven with the Jets, Michael with the Seahawks, Kevin with the Broncos, Jimmy with the Niners, Nick with the Colts, Brian with the Falcons, Nick with the Giants, Chris with the Vikings, Neil with the Jaguars, Steve with the Eagles, Mike with the Dolphins, Jimmy with the Panthers, uh, Nick with the Commanders, Brian with the Steelers, Chris with the Steel, uh, Brian with the Cowboys, Chris has the Steelers, Steve Birch with the Bears, Matt with the Patriots, Wes with the Packers, uh, Juan with the Chiefs, Robert with the spot that you won, Buffalo Bills, Carlos with the Titans, Corey with the Lions and Buccaneers, Mac with the Chargers, Aaron with my Raiders, Terry with the Browns, Steve with the Rams, Matt with the Bengals, Steve with the Saints, and Bill with the Houston Texans. Let's sort by alphabetically by team. And we're going to pause the video just for a little bit. We're going to see if there's any trades in this break right here. And when we come back, we'll see if there's any trades. And then we'll have uh, we'll crack that open and see which three boxes we're going to do. So stick around. We will be right back. All right, welcome back everybody. No deals were done, so this list right here remains the same. 2018 Contenders Football, random team number one. Thanks everybody for making this happen, I appreciate it. And here it is, 2018 Contenders Football. It's been a minute or two since we've seen these. So let's pop this case open. which boxes we're gonna do. Gosh, I think I remember back in 2018, we must have ripped dozens and dozens of cases of this. This is a... There we go. All right, so we have four stacks of three. So we're going to select a die, like that flamingo die right here. We'll go one, two, three, four on the dice roll. If I roll a five or a six, I'll roll again. Three, one, two, three. So we're going to do that column back there. And we will save these for next time. All right, here we go. Good luck, everybody. Looking for these guys right here, especially, especially Josh Allen and Lamar Jackson. I'd love to see a bounce back here from Saquon Barkley. Maybe Baker Mayfield in a different spot. You know, could be a change of scenery. Could be good for him. Correct. Yeah, I did not go to. Uh, yeah, well, I, did, I didn't go to a lot of football games when I, was a, when I was a kid, professional football games when I was a kid. And then, you know, the Southern California, like the Los Angeles area, just didn't have football for a couple decades. So that kind of 
that kind of put football out of reach for me. Um, but yeah, so I didn't go to my first Raiders game until until last year. Raiders Broncos. Raiders beat the Broncos in Las Vegas. Chaz, what's up? And Chaz is saying only one spot left in Contenders Optic Basketball. All right, someone grab that last team. Let's get it on the schedule. I'll go through some more orders after this. When this product first released, which player was the biggest hit from this product? I think probably Josh Rosen and Sam Darnold. Third redemptions, they're most likely expired. That's sort of the risk with this this older stuff. So just uh, just keep that in mind. We'll still send it to uh, the team that gets it. But there's Richard Sherman playoff ticket card to 175. We'll do a left right randomizer on those round numbered cards. First autograph. Oh, sorry, Colts. It's Jordan Wilkins, rookie ticket auto. Not sure if he's still around, but that goes to Nick Stover. And the Colts. Oh, right, Saquon. Yeah, the Saquon Barkley chase was, was, was pretty big. There he is. And we've got for the Bengals, we have Auden Tate. That'll be for Matt and the Bengals. For Miami, we got Durham Smythe. Yeah, it's crazy to think that that from uh, I mean, twenty eighteen wasn't too wasn't that long ago. And Josh Rosen, Josh Rosen is now now a free agent. There's Dylan Cantrell, rookie ticket autograph for the Chargers. That's going to be for Mac. Rookie ticket autograph, Corey Littleton. For the Rams, Steve Birch. And we've got Ito Smith, Judge Ito Smith, 40 out of 49. Rookie ticket on card auto for Brian and the Falcons. All right, box one, done. Box two of three. Yeah, the NFL, not for long. It is kind of crazy to see all these players, you know, and you just think, man, how many, how many of these guys, I guess Littleton's still around, but he's not with the Rams anymore. You know, is Auden Tate still around? You know, it's, Running backs are tough too. So yeah, I think it was like, it was mainly Saquon, I guess Baker to a certain extent, but maybe not until 
Oh yeah, Baker to a certain extent. Josh Rosen, I want to say, maybe he fell out of favor by the time Contenders came out. But Baker, Sam Darnold, Saquon Barkley. Remember the promos, if an auto of a particular quarterback was pulled, then break credit would be randomized someone in the break. I remember that. I think I... Th I think I also remember doing a break credit if uh, it was like a bounty. If we got all if we got all six in a break or something like that. Or if we did half case breaks, if we got all six in a full case, I would give away money or something. Mike Towers is from a break of this. You got a Josh Rosen, Josh Allen dual auto one of one. Do you still have it? Rex setting, it's funny, is actually, if you want to make a quick buck, you could become a football player for a year and then be set for life. You manage your money right. I suppose so. Maybe if you're, the, they don't get a lot of guaranteed money, though. I'm... No, Mike Tower does not have that dual auto. Yeah, I, I don't think many people thought... I mean, Josh Allen's arm talent was was no was not in question when he was drafted, but I don't think I don't think a lot of people really expected him to develop the way he has, or evolve the way he has. Same with Lamar Jackson, actually. And for the Bears, we've got. Ryan Nall, rookie ticket autograph. Steve Birch with Chicago. Obi-Wan, what's up? I pulled you a blue Josh Allen, number to 12 or 15. Don't remember now. Still have it? Well, for the Fly Eagles Fly, we've got Jordan Malata. He's still around. That is for Steve Birch and the Eagles. Eagles. You wonder what NFL rookies do when they don't make it, Rex? Well, and nowadays there's like alternatives, right? Like you could, you could get. There's Dorian O'Daniel. I suppose you could try to play in Canada, CFL. There's a lot of uh, semi-pro leagues, I feel like, that are around. The USFL is now back, so that's probably a way they can still play. Uh, Dorian O'Daniel goes to the Chiefs. That'll be for Juan, Obi-Wan. Chase Littleton. A Litton, that is. Rookie ticket autograph for the Chiefs. Another one for Juan. But yeah, after that, Rex, yeah, I think a lot of them, a lot of them just end up just getting regular jobs, I think. <laughs> they just become regular people. Interestingly enough, Rex, a lot of, a lot of football players are usually the most, are usually the best educated of all the pro athletes because, because they, um, because they uh, have usually have three or four years of college. There's Andrew Luck to 175. Uh, playoff ticket card going to Nick Stover and the Colts. So yeah, a lot of those guys end up just getting getting regular jobs or maybe selling cars at a car dealership or something like that. And we got a draft class autograph, Sam Darnold, 6 of 18. So we've been a monster hit in 2018. This is now a to-be-determined kind of hit. Hopefully he does well this year. Stephen Flat with the Jets with the spot that he won.
All right, that was the second box. Yeah, so football players have some options now. I think a lot of times, if you're on the fringe, and if you're drafted and you don't really make it, I think you can still grind it out on a practice squad for a while. USFL has just started. Spring football has just started. So there's that opportunity. The... Um, what should we call it? Yeah, so they got some opportunities there. Baseball, I mean, if you if you wash out of the minors in baseball, I don't know how many guys are going overseas. It's such a grind that I don't know. I mean, I think maybe some some will can, some will press on in in some uh, maybe in Mexico or something like that overseas, but I'm not sure. Basketball, there's definitely a lot of good overseas opportunities in Europe. If you don't make it in China, if you don't make it in the uh, in the U.S., baseball and basketball players tend to be the least educated, at least traditional education-wise, least educated amongst pro athletes because baseball players, a lot of them, can be drafted out of high school. And a lot of basketball players are, are one and done. Yeah, Johnny Manziel is supposed to be a big deal, Brandon. Robert saying alcohol ruined that guy, yeah. And I, some would argue that he also came from, like, privilege, right? You know, maybe, maybe he just didn't have, like, that edge, that extra hunger you kind of need to be a pro athlete. Maybe he didn't love the game enough. All right. I don't know. I'm sure there'll be a. I'm sure there'll be a Johnny Manziel documentary at some point. That'll get into all of that for the Purple Birds. Anthony Averett. I think is still around. That is for. Uh, Jake, for the Purple Birds. And we've got from Iowa, we have rookie ticket auto, Riley McCarron. For the Pats, that's going to be for Matt. Matt and the Pats. There's Richard Sherman to 175. Joey, it already did. If you check the schedule, you'll see that we, we did that uh, uh, earlier today, maybe a few breaks ago. And not, not that guy, but Tremaine Edmonds, rookie ticket, ticket stub autograph. That's 10 out of 49. Buffalo! Robert G. with the Buffalo Bills. Uh, points. We'll randomize that to one person in the break. That takes the place of an auto. And there's Christian Kirk, rookie ticket autograph for the Cardinals. He got a pretty decent contract. Canard with somebody else. Jaguar, maybe? Hopefully he does well there. Could be a nice nice one to hold on to. See how he does this season on that new contract. And that, my friends, is that. Did Ezekiel Elliott settle down? I, I have no idea. Uh, I don't know what his marital status is. All right, let's do some randomizing. We'll do a left-right randomizer, and then everyone has a shot at the 250 points. So let's flip back to the list here. Let's gather everybody's names. Put your names in here, and then we'll do a left-right randomizer. 
right there. Let's roll it. Let's randomize names and teams five and a one six times. Names and teams. Sides and names five and a one six times. One, two, three, four, five, and a one. Sixth and final time. That's going to be left side cards. We'll get those. And then everyone has a uh, shot at the points. Five and a one six times. One, two, three, four, five, and a one. Sixth and final time. Points are going to go to a little consolation prize for Kevin. There you go, Kevin. 250 points going your way after six. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next break. This wasn't a very long break, but I'll hit you with a recap. We did get that Sam Darnold, fingers crossed, that uh, he bounces back this season. That'd be nice. There you go, gang. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next football break. Bye-bye. Pre-order that NT football. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Bye-bye.